Should I buy or sell TQQQ? The report for TQQQ was first published on our website Friday, December 16, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Since December 16, 2022, our system ranks TQQQ as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of minus 0.873. In the period the stock had natural movements but currently sit with a loss of 0% since we first recommended hold slash accumulate. In our daily updates for TQQQ our last headline reads, TQQQ ETF upgraded from sell candidate to hold slash accumulate after Friday trading session. The TQQQ ETF price fell by minus 2.84% on the last day, Friday, December 16, 2022, from $19.70 to $19.14. It has now fallen four days in a row. During the last trading day the ETF fluctuated 5.87% from a day low at $18.71 to a day high of $19.81. The price has fallen in seven of the last 10 days and is down by minus 18.17% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the ETF, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the ETF. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 41 million shares and in total, 151 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.89 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the ETF was $87.49, and the lowest price was $16.32. Right now the price is 78.12%, or $68.35, below 52-week high and 89.97%, or $171.74, below all-time high January 8, 2021 where the price hit $190.88. The ETF is moving within a very wide and horizontal trend and further movements within this trend can be expected. The current three-month trend indicates a possible 1.05% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 8.84% and 25.48%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 72.67% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 100% and minus 71.11%. This equals a price between $0 and $5.53 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets The following signals have been found for TQQQ. There are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. The TQQQ ETF hold sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $21.03 and $21.05. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Thursday, December 1, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 19.33%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, sell signal 12 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 1 day ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 2 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 81 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 76 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for TQQQ
TQQQ finds support from accumulated volume at $18.20 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This ETF has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the ETF moved $1.10 between high and low, or 5.87%. For the last week, the ETF has had daily average volatility of 7.86%. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, TQQQ meets first resistance at $19.31. If you do not hold TQQQ shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn TQQQ finds first level of support at $18.20 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Our recommended stop loss is $17.96, minus 6.16%. This ETF has medium daily movements and this gives medium risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found 11 days ago. Is TQQQ ETF a buy? TQQQ holds several negative signals and this should be a sell candidate, but due to the general chance for a turnaround situation it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this ETF since the last evaluation from a sell to a hold slash accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Monday 19th we expect TQQQ to open up $0.0798 and start trading at $19.22. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the ETF? Remember